Alright, I promised this. This is Don, our drifting Corvette. Um, I also did a little update to the library. Um, I put the name of the person who named this car. Well, the, the username. It's kind of hard to see, so I'll probably move it, but... Um, I promised y'all I'd do the Colossus in this thing, so that's what's gonna happen. Oh, I don't know how to get the Colossus from here. Oh yeah, oh yeah. A little, uh, a little silly. Can't believe this thing goes this fast. God damn. So yeah. So I'm sorry about the wait. I promised I'd have this video like a half hour after the last video. I didn't realize how long it takes for that much video to upload. So. Um, here I am, after like two days, probably. I'm not gonna check at this moment. Probably been about two days. I just had a little few things happen, so. There's that, but. I think that speed zone time is some bullshit, to be honest. Instagram Reels! Oh god. So to be honest, I have no, I have no idea if this is gonna actually work. For Colossus, I've never tried to use this car on a track other than you know just the road, and that's kind of why right there. Uh, I kind of suck at controlling this, but it's still a fun car. <laughs> like a glove. Oh yeah. I'm gonna be honest, the goal for this video is not even to win the Colossus. If I win the Colossus, that'd be, you know, obviously, good, but, I, 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 to be honest, I don't know, man, I think the goal is to get, like, top five, to be honest, because I have no idea what I'm doing, I might get, I might lock in and get 
really good. Oh, what was that Jeep doing in the middle of the road? Silly Jeep. You've lung off the road or something. Takes forever to stop. 34.3 miles of drifting. Let's, let's do this. Oh, Vulcan AMR. When this video is over, I'll, I'll share my what I'm going to do for the next video. I don't want to say it yet, but I, it's a good idea. Probably. Let's do this. Let me just give her a tune real quick. I do want to try something. I want to try as much negative camber on the back as possible because I noticed when I turned it up to three degrees, I had a lot more control over the car. And I'm going to reduce my tow out because I noticed that decreases control. Uh, as low as it'll go. I don't know how to do any of this soft, stiff stuff. Fine. Hi. You have to be so noisy while I'm recording. You messed up cat. You fatty messed up cat. I'm just bullying my cat, it's fine. Alright, let's do this. Oh, that Grand National Florida. I don't think any of these other cars are, are drift cars. Ooh, that was good though. Oh, that wasn't so good though. Yeah, none of these other cars are drift. Okay. Redneck Jesus! Say I say, love thy neighbor. Oh yeah. I don't even know if I'm gonna get top five, dude. Four percent in. I'm already at tenth place. Normally by now I'm already in fifth or sixth. Oh yeah, eleven. What could possibly be behind me? What slow ass car is behind me? That's not the right view. Is that a Mustang? Looks like one. That wasn't the road. Here, I'm gonna try to just not drift to see if I can. No, no. Not. Nah. Y'all came here to watch a drift car do a not drift track. You're gonna see a drift car drift. Even if I'm really bad at it. gonna take forever.
give it a little wall sack. Oh yeah. Even if I'm really slow, that was pretty smooth. Especially for keyboard and mouse, like damn. Drifted around that, watch this. Even if it's an e-drift. I can't believe it didn't stop my little skill chain for that. So incredibly far behind. Unless there's a 30 car pile up in a 12 car race, I don't think I'm gonna. I don't think I'm gonna get top 10. Oh, Something that kind of helps when you're drifting is if you have to change direction, you let off the accelerator, and then you do a sharp turn, and then once you're just about in the direction you want to be, then you accelerate and turn the opposite direction. A lot of drifting is countering your car wanting to turn, while also making sure it stays in angle. So when I'm drifting, I'm constantly pressing like W, A, and D um, to steer this thing. Not like that though. That kind of sucked. You don't want to turn around like that because when you end up doing that 180 kind of, or when you turn around, it slows you way down and it doesn't look as smooth. And if you're interested, if you like doing the drift challenges, it fails you usually. Maybe this will be fun up here. All right, let's get her done. Oh yeah, that was nice. Should I put anti-lag on this thing? I think it sounds really good. And anti-lag would help performance-wise but it also would mask the sound. And it doesn't help performance-wise too much. It just gives me a little extra horsepower that I barely need. You know what, how about this? I'm gonna tell you early, but next video I was planning on doing a muscle build for drag racing. Comment if I should do a muscle build a rally build, like an off-road drifter. I'll do one or the other. 
whichever one I don't do, I'll do in the next video, but comment which one I'll, I'll do first. I constantly need ideas, so anyone who's got ideas, just throw them in the comments. Sucked up, bug. Take every bit of directing advice that I give with a grain of salt because I'm not really the best at it, but I'm, I'm figuring it out slowly. I'm still kind of new to it. Donuts I can do. Drifts I cannot. Very well in that. that was I will say with this game, um, the little analogy I'm going to give is going to make sense to like three people ever. Um, but to me, since I do welding in real life, um, drifting in this game and really doing anything is kind of like it's kind of like welding, because you eventually just kind of figure it out. It's not one of those things that you need to really think about it, you just, no, muscle memory, you figure it out. But, like, drifting in this game is very much like that. I couldn't, like, give a lesson on drifting on keyboard. Because I don't have, like, random, like, key presses. I'm not randomly pressing A and B. I'm pressing them with purpose, um, but I couldn't, like, tell you, like, this is why I'm pressing the A key now, and now I'm going to press the D key in order to do this. It's just for control. What I could do... Could try to do this in first person so you can see like when I'm letting off and when I'm going on. Seeing when I'm steering. So if you look down at my dash, the one on the left is my engine RPMs, the one on the right is my speed. And obviously the wheel's direction. So you can see I'm breaking here. Probably gonna try to get a good one up here so I can show you all. Nope, that was pretty bad. That's a good one. So to start that drift, I went on the handbrake and just tapped it, and it starts spinning the tires in the back because it slips the car up a little bit. And then from there, I can just constantly drift. Another good way to start a drift is to kind of weave the car back and forth. Not right here. Not a little bit. Like here. Just weave the car back and forth. And you can see it slips. This is really hard to do in first person. Gone. There we go. But so when I get to a turn like this, I can be on the brakes and then accelerate, and that'll slip the rear tires and it'll put me into a drift. Around a turn like this, right, I can tap my handbrake, and that'll get me drifting. That's an E drift because I'm using the emergency brake. Sometimes, if you're on a track like this, where sometimes dirt slips into the road, you can slip the car on the dirt. 
Uh, and like I was saying earlier, you can kind of just leave the car. And eventually, it loses control. And then you can control it into a grip. Um, it's not easy, by any means. Unless, you know, you know what you're doing. Which, you know, you're looking for someone that knows what they're doing with drifting, go somewhere else. I am not that guy. Um, but I'm, I'm figuring it out along the way as I go. That was pretty good. It was a very slight drift, but it was a very crisp one to tap. Oh, jeepers. Oh, jeepers. Even though I'm losing the Colossus, uh, really badly right now. Like, <laughs> really badly. God, they're almost done. Um... It was still a good experience to try this and to kind of show you guys what drift is kind of, why drift is so difficult. When you're on like the open road, it's different because if you slip up, oh, you just go off the road and just, you know, go back onto the road and start over. With this, if I slip up, I slam into a wall and seven cars pass me at least. Very sensitive. It's much different. But racing drift? You're usually going to be doing a formula drift car, and that was kind of the goal with Dawn, was I wanted a car that was not a formula drift car, but could compare to one. And I've done that. I showed that on uh, some drift zone somewhere. I got like 900,000 drift points. And then one of my buddies that has a formula drift car that he used for that, got like a million. I don't remember where that drift zone is, I'll have to look at it. I'll have to look around. Or on the mountain, on the wavy mountain, when I got 600,000 drift points. I don't know if I put that on video, but that's a thing. That might have been me talking to a friend. I don't know. I'll show it off at the end of the video or something. Oh yeah, they all finished 100%. It's really interesting that they didn't have drift tires. I would think it would put drift tires on the cars, but it didn't. I've never raced a drifter. So. No idea what to expect, but uh, definitely a fun race. Oh, geez. Ooh, man. Rift fat. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're already done. Oh, jeez. Lost a little control there. There we go.
Oh, Jesus. Oh yeah, shock and awe. Yeah, I'm kind of like those cars that passed by like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I've never lifted the back of a car. Opposite of a wheelie. Wheelie. Oh man. Hey, two wheels. Oh. Uh, got some nice barriers here. Me crash into them. Yeah, they all finished so, so much earlier than I did. We're going to drift the hell out of this thing really badly and then sideways through the finish line. Like, we owned that race, which we did. Hell yeah, 20 minutes. Pontiac Trans Am, nice. Hi. You have to be so noisy while I record. All my millions of viewers can hear you. Juan Carlo. Crown Vic. We got destroyed by a Crown Vic. Oh yeah. So baller. I've never I've never performed better. Two Corvettes. Literally the same same car, except mine has drift tires. Ah, I, like I like wheel spins. Sometimes they get a lot of money. See? And there's another one, and then... Here, here. Let's see. Let's see what wild thing I get from the wheel spin. Another 5,000. Wowzers. Wowzers, wowzers, wowzers. So yeah, that was the sad, sad attempt of Dawn racing the Colossus. Um, this poor thing. Uh, let me know in the comments if next video I should do a muscle build or a rally build. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.